There are a number of different cobalt um, sources for supplementing. Cobalt is an important um, mineral that's required by sheep. It's, it's used by the bugs in the rumen to metabolize vitamin B12, which is important for lamb thrive. There are a number of different signs that we see on farms that have cobalt deficiency. We can have lambs with scaly ears, uh, poor thrive, uh, dried out wool, ill thrift, generally signs of ill thrift, and in severe cases, pine, where the lambs actually go backwards and if they're not treated, they, they, they will die. When it comes to, to cobalt supplementation, we need to be putting in a supply of cobalt there on a continual basis because it's not stored in the body. There are a number of different options. In terms of making sure that the cobalt we're using works, we need to make sure that the cobalt is available in the rumen where the bugs need it, not further down the digestive tract. There are a number of different cobalt um, sources for supplementing. We have ionic cobalt, which is available in the rumen. We have cobalt sulfate, which is also available uh, in the rumen. And then we have cobalt oxide formulation, co sorry, cobalt carbonate formulations, which are not available in the rumen. They're, they're not available at, at that pH of, of, of 6.5 and above. So the, the important thing when we're supplementing the lambs is that we supplement in time before we have that ill thrift. Really, for, for depends on your level of cobalt efficiency on your farm, but for, for most flocks, that cobalt supplementation probably needs to really start before weaning. In, 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 in severely deficient farms, it might need to start even you know, prior to 10 weeks of age. If you're in doubt as to whether you have a cobalt deficiency, or you are in doubt as to whether the product you are using is working on your farm, a very simple way to find out whether you need the mineral supplement that you are giving is to treat a proportion of the flock and to monitor the performance. So in the case of lambs, if you're, if you're concerned that you're feeding, using a product that may not be working or whether you need the product at all, what we would suggest is that you would treat every second lamb going up the race and mark them and monitor the performance of the lambs that are, are treated compared to a cohort of the lambs that are not treated. It is important when you're doing this that you treat every second lamb as opposed to treating the first 50 lambs going out the race um, first with the product and leaving the last 50 untreated because very often the lambs that go through the race towards the end are lambs that are lame or shy or poor performers are being bullied by the better lambs and tend to stay to the back. So we want to get a representative sample when we're, we're checking to see whether we're getting a benefit from a mineral treatment.